From figuring out what consumers want to development and testing, a lot happens before a product comes to market. GMO seeds are products too, but why are new GMOs made? Give it a minute. Scientists continue to develop GMO seeds to help farmers overcome many challenges, including managing pests, conserving water, and ultimately producing enough to feed us all. But GMOs don't happen overnight. Developing them takes incredible collaboration and research. On average, this takes around 13 years and can cost up to $130 million. During this time, promising products undergo hundreds of different tests. Some make sure a product is nutritionally equivalent to its conventional counterpart. Other tests examine environmental and food safety, as well as product benefits. But two primary things will bring this process to a halt. One, if a product doesn't meet safety criteria. The other, if a product isn't beneficial. Because if it doesn't work, farmers won't buy it. And in any country where GMO seed products will be grown, or where the food and feed crops the seeds produce will be imported, regulators there need to review and approve them as well. That's up to 60 countries and hundreds of regulators. After approvals are complete, this new seed choice is ready for work. As for the scientists, they're on to the next challenge. That's a lot to cover in a minute. So if you still have questions, check out discover.monsanto.com.